you're getting tired of cooking your usual recipes, a nonprofit in Maine has a solution that could help mix up your routine and reconnect you with nature at the same time. News 8's Nora Hogan spoke with the director of Rewild Maine about the edible plants that grow right in our backyard. All people should have access to a place where they can learn about the plants that they share their life with, share the land with. Zach Rudolph founded Rewild Maine with the goal of helping people connect with nature in an accessible way. So we offer a series of classes and workshops that are focused on what we call small scale place based living skills. So these are the skills used by humans all around the world to survive and thrive outside the realm of industrialism. Their signature program is the Wild Edibles Walking Tour, which brings people around the Eastern Prom in yeah, Portland's East End, right in teaching them how to spot right, and really use good. plants in cooking and home remedies. Wow. Portland has so many wild plants, wild edible and medicinal plants right under our nose. The Eastern Prom alone is home to over 30 edible species, including wild blueberries, sumac, St. James wort, and Japanese knotweed, which can all be either eaten or used as medicinal tinctures. And certainly throughout history, when times are tough, people turn back to the gifts of the earth. Through these workshops, Ruda hopes to inspire a greater appreciation for our surroundings. It can make us think more deeply about our interdependence on natural systems, and it can encourage us, hopefully, to find more sustainable ways of being. To learn more about these tours and workshops, you can visit rewildmaine.org. In Portland, Nora Hogan, WMTW News 8.